cultivate means to hachar. God said to Adam, cultivate the ground. To cultivate means you receive it, but don't give it back in the state you found it. You increase its quality. You maximize its effectiveness and efficiency. So, God gives you a woman who is a wife, but you have to make her one with you. You, don't, you are not one in the beginning. Okay? He, he gives you a, a house. It has to be a home. He gives you a seed. It has to be a child. It is what it means to cultivate. is to bring it to its highest quality. So your prayer level, it needs to turn from prayer request to cultivation. You have to learn to cultivate in your spirit. To cultivate means you spend time in prayer, but not just to speak, but to listen. You, you start to help your spirit man to know how to avoid distractions. When I go into prayer, people complain, I've been trying to call you. Is because at that time I'm not praying. I've moved from that level to cultivation. You, you take the word that God has been giving you. You meditate on it. That's what it means to hard, to meditate. When you look at the book of Isaiah that mentioned to hachar, it's when a lion has got a prey and it puts its claws on the prey. And then it says, when all other hyenas and the likes, they want to come and take the prey. The land does not even consider them. It begins to absorb, to eat what it has caught. That's the weight of God. You hachar, you found it, you eat it, you, you, you meditate, you, you, you speak it, you declare it, you think about it, you, you allow it to change your mind, to go deep into your spirit. That's what it means to cultivate.